Hey all, this is the season premiere of Bipolar Opposite, season three. Wow, have I really been doing this for two years now? Damn. Well, anyway, you found this, and for that, I'm grateful. Oh, damn. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Tim Cubbin, and I am your host for the following nine segments. Ten segments, you ask? But season two is only six segments. Well, guess what? The show will now be longer. You're welcome, I say. So, I must state that this season will be very different from the past season. First off, I am now a professional. That's right. I'm a college graduate with a degree in English journalism. So, you may wonder what drew me to journalism. I have been a Spider-Man fan for over 20 years. And most of you will know that Peter Parker, Spidey's alter ego, was a photographer for the newspaper The Daily Bugle. I always thought photography was cool in my... thing. Well, it's turned out that it was not my thing. Sure, I loved taking pictures, but I wasn't good at it. I took a few months of, in a photography class in high school, which was rather embarrassing. I had had a teacher uh, transfer the negatives from film and realized it just wasn't right for me. Sure, I'll take pictures, but mostly selfies, or occasionally using my 3D to take photos, but I'm not all that serious anymore. But it just wasn't my calling in life. So how did I get here? Well, back in high school, I came up with an idea for a book. Well, I sat on it for a long time. Deciding it wouldn't work. But, a few years back, the magic struck. My story was amazing. I totally planned to get it published. I also came up with an idea for seven other books in a series. Now, you're probably wondering at the, mom uh, at the moment, but in a few years my books will come flying off the shelves. Oh my god, I digress. So, when I started working for my associate's degree, I had wanted to be a teacher for several years, but it just wasn't for me. I just couldn't do it properly, so I switched to my desire to English. I decided that writing was what I wanted most. So, I picked up a mind in journalism, thinking if I couldn't get a game of my books, I could still get some with my journal with journalism. Sure, I wouldn't be a photographer like Pierre Parker, but I could be a great reporter like Ben Urich. Still the same field, so I'm in journalism. And then, in one of my classes, I was bit by the radioactive spider and created by Polar Opposites as a news program. My first season came out of randomness and was pretty disjointed. So, what if turning by Polar Opposites into a news program? It just might work. And so, here I am, talking to you. Why did I choose making my program as a video, you ask? Well, I thought it was more personable. Writing posts just would not get the same attention that a video could and would get. People could actually see me, which is more appealing, but also more difficult. Putting myself out there for the whole world to see me. But my nerves have calmed down, and I record my show on video. Now, there are some of my new viewers should under, should understand that I obviously need to know that I always need to know before I continue my show, and I probably should tell that. I am myself bipolar. I always say the phrase polar opposites. So I started out wanting to use polar opposites in some way. When I decided to make a news program, I realized that journalists had to be unbiased and started out my news stories which all those perspectives, not just my own, but now how both opposite sides worked. This is, after all, my show and my creation, so I should not be the only voice heard here because I am a professional. And so, from there, Bipolar Opposites was born. Okay, now we need to get some new stuff. First off, I might be difficult to prepare properly. I had this moment without teeth. A complete oral extraction performed a few months back, and I'm in the process of getting feelings for dentures, so try extra hard to hear me. I am also in the process of moving into a new office. It might take a few more episodes, so look forward to it. It's really a nice, a nice office.
Also this is the season, I am abandoning the previews of the content of the show. If you want to know what's going to be on the show, you just have to watch. Also, the order of the segment style will not be said at the specific point in the show, so again, watch out for that. And the biggest challenge of the whole season is, is what you is, the biggest change the whole season is you get more of me. I'm not being a robot. A true personality will be shown on the show now. So hopefully I make it better for your enjoyment. Well, I think the best thing you can do now is go on to clip two.